for dinner where every day we make really delicious, wonderful meals. My name is Mary Jo Eustace and I'm excited and bright today and this is my lovely co-host. Ken Costa. Ken Costa. And I'm very excited today. Why? I don't know. Why? Because I look good. You do look I good. I do, don't I? You look kind of sexy today. And I can't believe that I'm noticing that. You just that. said that. Yeah. And you look very yeah, sexy. What? Years, uh, nothing. Is it happening? Is that a newspaper shirt? What is that? Your Moschino baby. Yes. Very nice. And your little dance pumpkin pants that you're wearing there. Now, what are you making today, I am doing one of my mom's favorite recipes. Really? What are you going to do? I'm doing her uh, uh, oh, chicken, know, do baked you? chicken you need your recipe in heard? mushroom sauce. That sounds delicious. Now that's that's uh, down-home cooking if yes. I've ever heard of down-home cooking. Come and get it. And I'm doing, obviously, at the soup station. What are you doing over at the soup oh, station? Oh, there's a lot happening over there, isn't there? Is, is it seafood? It's a Manhattan clam chowder. Get out of town. And it's spicy. <laughs> Put her there. High five, baby. <laughs> oh my gosh, you got me today. Sexy little dude, that extra energy from my outfit worked. Got you up higher than normal. Now what I'm oh. doing today, I'm doing delicious lazy braising leeks. And what we do is we saute bacon and shallots and onion. And then we bake our leeks with raisins and a little hooch and whatnot and so forth. What? You're a bad girl. I'm a bad girl. I'm going to spank bad. you in between. Then. Do you think so? Yeah. Oh, promises, promises. See yep. you in a minute here See on, in a minute on the once cooking show that rocks. <laughs> And welcome back to What's for Dinner. I've just started chopping up my onion. I'm going to chop up my garlic. And this is a really easy recipe to do. All you do is you uh, saute your onion and your garlic. And I'm also going to, you know, do something a little bit more. I'm going to start to saute my chicken. Oh, that sounds really good. Then you put it in the casserole dish. Yeah. You put over your dried herb mixture. You are being so professional. And right off the top, what's going on? Your mushroom soup. Oh, your mushroom soup. Yeah. So do, okay. Do in the oven, 350. Do you coat your chicken breasts first to get them a bit golden? Well, that yeah. was like such a ballerina, like mamsy pamsy, artsy fartsy move. Yeah. It's, look, it's I do want to get a shot of these pants because they remind me. What do those pants look like? They look like there's something about the the pleat or whatever that. Ski pants. Ski pants. There we I go. I pray ski pants. They're very. Don't be doing anything like that. Now, what I'm going to do for my lazy hey, baby. crazy. Oh, oh my God! It's unnerving. Are you, can I ask you a question? What? Free for boxer. <laughs> Panties. What do you wear? Caustic. Caustic? What do you think I wear? I think you wear a little tiny briefs with your name written on the top. <laughs> That's what I think. That your mother's sewn in your name tags. <laughs> oh, you're, you're a, a semi-brief brief guy, aren't no. you? No, it's... It not a full brief. It's not a boxer, that's for sure. Let's just put it that way. Now I'm going to get my pan off to the races, and with these leeks, what you do is you saute your onions and your bacon. <laughs> Thank you so much for sharing that. Um, and then what we're going to do is put our leeks in and our port and our wine, and we're going to braise these leeks, because oh. leeks are right on and delicious, don't you think? Right. I think they're yummy. So you know what I did yesterday? What did you do? I went with my son. Yes. To uh, Little Chapters. Jack. Little Jackster. Yeah. And we went to the music section. Of? Uh, chapters. Yes. And I put some headphones on and he listened to Cuban music. Oh. Went bananas. Loved it. Loved it. And was like chewing the little cord for the thing and drooling all over it. But he has got total rhythm, dancing, and then he played some bongos after. Well, he loves to listen to you sing. He loves it so when mommy sings. But that's, he's, uh, he, he's, you know, he might have a musical career. Major. He's very artistic. Yeah. He's going to do something in the arts for sure and I encourage that. Whatever he wants to be, he can be. Hairdresser? I don't care. If he's good. If he perms and colors well, I don't care. That's right. As long as he feels good about himself. That's right. That's the important thing. Don't you think, though? He's very, very happy. I love the fact that he's very happy. He's a very happy little boy. And he boy. laughs at everything, and he giggles. He laughs at all your jokes. He does. Well, he loves his father. Let's yeah. just put it that way. <laughs> now I'm chopping up my shallots, and I'm going to put some delicious bacon. And this is a very hearty dish. We're doing sort of a hard... Oh, what did I touch there? <laughs> oh, it's padded today, the man's ear. <laughs> the man's ear. Very sexy. This is kind it's of a... Push -up. It's sort of a hearty uh, night tonight, don't you think, Costa? It is. It is. But I like it. I like things hearty, have I told you? I do. And so, what am I doing? Oh! Oh, what are you doing? Oh, I've got to do rice, too. Oh, oh my gosh. Oh, yeah. So, uh, that's the other thing i got to do. It, i got to do rice. <laughs> are you going to have a body double come I, in and do your <laughs> rice in the brain? I need to read this. Have a good okay. read. Is that from your mother's cookbook, etc.? Yeah. Uh-huh. And now I'm going to uh -huh. put my shallots in and get those off to the races. <laughs> And uh, this is going to be absolutely delicious. This is actually quite good with roasted chicken or any type of chicken. What, baby? Oh, I see, What's I wrong? see, I see. So what I have to do 
is the rice bakes in the oven. Yes. So I have to put the water and everything in there with the once chicken. I, with the chicken. Because can I tell you something right yes, now? Yes, baby. If you don't get this recipe right, rumor has it Helen's in town. Yeah. She'll kick the crap out of you. Oh, she would be very <laughs> upset with I you. Oh, I know. I was actually talking to your mother earlier today. Yeah. She's very happy. Yeah. Andy dumped his girlfriend. I know. Yeah. I know. And apparently she's working here now. Ah, don't be. <laughs> Why can't I tell? I can't, can I? Would I get in trouble? You might get in trouble. Apparently she's stripping in Toronto, oh, which is, what, what did I say? Mrs. Kostick told me that she had a real good talking to him, and he's on the straight and narrow now. Yeah, well. You know, don't you think? I hope so. He's like a little brother. Oh, my gosh, he's so handsome. Don't you so, think? Yeah. You're ignoring me now, pretty poor, much. Poor Andy. Well, he's doing well now. He's on the road to recovery. You know what I think I'm going to do? What are you going to do? I'm just going to put everything, once I brown the chicken, in here... Listen to this. Oh, gosh. Oh, yeah. I think um, I'm... Yeah. What, darling? And then I'll... Tra once everything starts boiling... There we go. To quicken the cooking time, baby. What are you going to do? Are you going to transfer your format of cooking? Right. From the sauté pan to into your, the casserole, into the oven, 350. There you go. That's, now, holy bacon. That sounds so delicious. Now, my bacon is going to go into my... Can you cut that for, for your... No, I'm your, not doing... No, 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 no. Okay, I will. No, I'll do it. My bacon is very um, delicious. Going over to the drop-off center. <laughs> okay. To put. Now, let me just review. Drop-off hygiene. Drop-off hygiene, high-tech sanitation. This is this is hygiene. Sanitation hygiene. And high-tech high information. Tech, the high-tech center is back. Yeah. Um, now, another thing that might be good in this dish is some pancetta. I love pancetta, which is slightly heartier and thicker than bacon. Okay, I'm just going to put all of this in because you know what? I don't have the time. And we'll get this off to the races. And I'll put in my red onions. Do you like leeks, Kenneth Kay? I love leeks. Are they delicious? But a lot of people are afraid of leeks. Why? Well, they're not sure what to do. They're, first of all, they're not sure how to cut them. Yes. And you're going to show them. Oh. And, and then uh, you really have to cook them up. You do. You have to cook to them. To make them clean. tender. You look nice today. D don't be looking no, at do. me. No, you do. Your mascara, your false eyelashes uh, are really nice uh, today. Mama. Now, what I did is you can see I've gone in between the skin and cleaned well. And you always should. Uh, when you're doing your leeks, because a lot of dirt can form it. What? I, 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 I do look good, don't I? I? No, I was thinking I'm going to do the tip of the day. Go, this baby. Is going to be riveting. The smaller the leek, the more tender it's going to be. There you go. Oh, I've heard that excuse before. Oh. Now we'll just do this and give this a little <laughs> swirl of root. Mama, you got to chop that no, up. No, I was tired today. I didn't want to. Actually, I'm going to chop it after when it's cooked. Just that little piece. What? Okay. You, you pointed out an imperfection. Now the good thing about this dish, one pot, right? It could be. Oh, but isn't no, it doing you put the I'm chicken using in? I'm two pots, yeah. Yeah, but one pot to cook. Yeah. Because you don't have to brand your chicken breast if you don't want to. Yeah. Now, you don't have anything to do, so you'll chop the onion for your little friend. You know, friend. I went to see this singer the other night, right? Uh, who? Uh, Patti LaBelle. No, her name's Amy, and she is one of these kind of bluesy type singers. Right. But, and the place was packed. Yes. And I was standing, you know, uh, at this kind of open window area. Yes. And this woman, you know, was, was drunk who came to stand beside me. Yes. But not only was she drunk. Oh. Oh, yeah. And she had one of these. So every time Amy sang, she would, like, groove to it. <laughs> you know, so she was grooving up Kenny. Oh. And, oh that wasn't good. <laughs> Were you wearing that outfit you're wearing today? <laughs> Very she, close to it. Uh, what's grooving this doing here? I just want you to chop it for me. Okay. So, anyways. A little sexual harassment. Then, afterwards. then, uh, sh don't you hate this? Did, whenever you did a concert, yes. would anybody start singing out in the crowd with you? Um, sometimes. Is that not, a, as a singer, is that not annoying? It's That's got to be unnerving. It's a bit annoying, but when somebody knows your songs and they're singing the back too, then it's kind of okay a little. Yeah, was well, she doing I, that? She was doing that, but she was, A, she had a very bad voice. Yes. B, she was really drunk. And yes. every time she would sing, she had the hiccups on top of it. Right. So as she would, uh, <laughs> you know, okay, she... hygiene right now. <laughs> Trivia question for my little friend. You got so into that story, something happened there. Kenny, this is actually one of my favorite what? bands. What 80s band sang? I'm not doing uh, trivia. Six months in a leaky boat. Six months in a leaky boat. Oh, okay, what do that? I get? Uh, this shirt, we'll switch shirts. Okay. Because this could look nice on you. See you in a minute here on Qu'est-ce que c'est pour le dîner? Oh, you're touching me. 
Hello and welcome back to What's for Dinner. I'm just uh, sauteing my onions with my bacon for my lazy braisin leeks and then I'm going to put them in my baking dish with my leeks and my carrots, raisins, port wine and a little oil and S&P. Now what I'd like to do for my good friend Kenny Kay is repeat the trivia question okay, for me. Okay, you, you promised me something if I get this right. If you get this right, we'll switch shirts. Okay. Okay, what 80s band sang the famous song, Six Months in a Leaky Boat, Six Months in a Leaky Boat? I think it was Split Ends. Did I get it right? Did I get it right, Mama? How the heck did he know that? Yes, how did you? Take it off. Well, I'll take it off later. How did you know that? I don't know. You're, don't a, know. Uh, you're really I'm a... a I'm a well-seasoned... Performer? Yeah. Type deal? Type oh, thing? Okay, what I've done is I've added in my water, the rice. In goes my dried herb mixture. I've got a little salt, pepper, uh, parsley, and some, uh, is that cayenne? I don't, well, it's red. It's paprika or cayenne. It is Do you paprika. not study your recipes before the don't show? Don't even look. Obviously not. Don't even look. That's a given. And then I mix in the mushroom soup. We use one can of mushroom soup. And we're going to bring this to a boil. And then put it in the casserole dish, 350 yes. for 25 minutes. And you have wonderful roasted chicken with mushrooms. Okay, well, I'm going to join you in the oven. Do you mind if my dish snuggles up side uh, by baby, side to your baby, chicken dish? This is a high-tech show. Yes. The warming station has two areas. Oh, upper we have two ovens, lower. upper and lower. Okay, because I What do you want to be? You want to be an upper or you want to be a lower? I'm definitely an upper. Is that a problem? <laughs> now, I am just uh, julienning my leaves for my dish. someone say excellent. Oh, baby. Okay. Yes. I need to be going to the drop-off center. What are you dropping off? This. The kids at the pool? What there are you we doing? Go. There you and go. And if you want to follow me in my dance pants. Follow? What are you going to do? Over to my soup station. Now, this is your Manhattan clam chowder. Baby. Is it not? It is. Oh, my gosh. You're so excited today. I am little very pants. excited. I, you know, I took all my pills. Did you? Yeah. Did you really? Yes. You'll oh. be very pleased about that. Okay. But keep taking them on a regular basis because okay. you know what happens when you don't take them. I know. I know. Got to sustain, Kenny. Medication oh. is a beautiful thing. In goes my onion. Right on. My green pepper. And we're going to saute this in a little bit of oil. And I'm just going to talk about the soup and then I'll do it. Do we, what? We do the. Oh, do make the soup. Is yeah. this a red or white one? This is a uh, red one because we're adding in stewed tomatoes, baby. Okay, so it's a Manhattan. Right. All right. And the the key to this it's soup, I got to tell you something. Boat. Whoops. Is what? Is we saute, we add the soup stock in, we have a little bit of red wine, clam juice, and the key ingredient. You know when you go to the store. Would it be cocktail seafood sauce that you buy in a oh. can or like a jar or something? Oh. That it, would that be what? You have read. You have been reading my recipes. I would not be reading your recipes. You no, are no, trying no, no, no. to plagiarize Kenny. No, I'm not. Yes. I'm not. It's just something that I thought of on my own. That is. It's the seafood cocktail sauce that goes in that gives it the kick. What you want? The, the oh my gosh. The kick. It gives you the little oomphur. All right. Okay. Well, that sounds like, now, do you put potatoes in this in the whole shebang? I do, baby. Okay, that sounds I do. really good. And I have some um, uh, dried herb mixture yes. that you will be sitting on the edge of your seat for a little bit later. I already am. What can I tell you? In goes the, the potatoes. Yes. Here's a really, really good time saver. What's your time if saver? If you wanted to go over to the radiation Then you can heat station, up your soup stock, basically. Is put, that what you're going to tell me? That's right. Microwave your... No, no. Microwave your, your potatoes. Your cocktail sauce? Your potatoes. Oh, your potatoes. Okay, yeah. that sounds delicious. Now, if anybody cares what the big attractive girl's doing, because I think some people do, right? I get a lot of your mail from young men who do care what I'm doing, and I am wearing a tight shirt today. What I'm going to do is put my leeks... And that I'm, shirt is coming off. It's coming off, baby. Um, I'm lining uh, my pan with my leeks, and I've got my bacon and my onions here. Oh, this is going to be yummy. And we'll put this in. You know, the, you know, Mary Jo, the woman who wrote your cookbook with you? Yes. Her name's Joanna Weinstein. Hosanna Weinstein, yeah. Right. She, have you ever told anybody she works on this show? And that she is like our food? Desperate? 1-800-desperate. Yeah, 1-800-desperate. She needs desperate. a man, She's first looking of all. for a man, that's but, for sure. But if you ever... Where's the camera? If you ever hear kind of like a giggling sound... Her medication's kicked in. Her and Kenny share the same that, medication. That's her laughing on the other side of the camera Here set. she is right now. She's attractive. She's fun. Yeah. She's nice. She's single. Yeah. She likes to play backgammon, go for long walks in the park, and skinny dip nude. So, you might want to call 1-800-desperate. Oh! <laughs> this is... This is... This is the desperate girl here. Yeah. This is her. She laughs at all our jokes. Yes. But baby, baby, if yes. you're going to get a man, 
Do your you, hair? You, you have to use some product in the hair, baby. I tried some of your product. Actually, you know what? Let's do a little outing on Get the out. show. Get Let's on do an outing show. on the show. Kenny and Joanna are an item. No. <laughs> I heard uh, Joanna and Kenny's dressing room, and all I heard was, Kenny, Kenny, <laughs> Kenny. I vomited. That, Trust you know me, why? I vomited. You know why she was going, Kenny, 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 you're so wonderful? Why? She was reading my cookbook. I doubt it, baby. Yeah. I doubt it. Anyways, that's where the little chuckling you the hear little, comes yeah. from. Yeah, we got to get her some guy. Seriously, I can't take it anymore. That, the calls, I know, the late that's night a calls. Problem. Hi, I'm Erjit. Hello. Joanna, how's uh -huh. it going? Uh -huh. um, listen, see you at work tomorrow. Bye. Seriously, yeah. we got to do something. It's getting a bit whack. Now there are my links and, and my and whatnot. The, the the girl is whack. She's whacked, man. Yeah. She's got some serious damage. Yeah. But she's, I like her. She's rich. She is rich. Now I'm putting in some white wine and I've got some sherry and we'll put raisins and I've just got to cut Ooh, up my carrots. I've got to put this in the oven. This is going to go into the oven. These I'm are so I'm talking delicious. about Joanna's love life and I know. I'm forgetting my recipe. I know. But you know what? I actually have somebody in mind for her. Do you? And once he gets out of prison, they're going to be a fabulous couple. I think so. Perry uh, with the monster truck, my neighbor. Mm, no? I don't know. I don't know. Oh, uh, so oh, you're yeah, an okay. upper. Yeah. I'm a lower. You are, you are a lower passive baby. Uh, thank you for your interest in the program, What's for Dinner. In response to your question, Ken and Mary Jo are not married to one another. Any reference to... Uh, this is just so nuts. Okay, we're not married. Um, no. Are Ken Costick and Mary Jo Eustace married in real life, or do they just play it suggesting that this is a case on their show? They are a hoot. I'm not really a big cook, but I delight in watching them prepare their di di dishes and their Read constant much? bandering. It's uh, hooked on phonics. It's hilarious and helps me to unwind after a long day. Keep up the good work. You took the Hooked on Phonics course, did. didn't you? And I still can't speak right. <laughs> and you've totally improved. That's a really, I love, this comes off of our high tech center over here. And when it comes off first thing in the morning, I peruse it. Then I put it back at our cooling station. What? At the cooling station. Cooling station, yeah. Right. Yeah. Remember I used to st uh, say always on the show, I'm not going to cook no more. Yeah. But you've gotten better now. I, 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 I've gotten much better. You I are. just say I'm going to quit. Very nice. I'm, and, I'm quitting. And I support you in that endeavor. Yeah. In goes our red wine. Yeah. And we have our clam juice. Oh, love clam. Hey, you know what? Can I make a suggestion? Well, I'm not that big on clams. Um, can actually. I make a suggestion there, you sexy dude? Yeah, what? P pick me. Yeah. Pick, okay. yeah. Just okay. pick me. Um, could you not use clamato juice in this? You could. Wouldn't that be delicious? You could use clamato juice. Thank you so much. Very yeah. much. We're going to dance later here on What's for Dinner. Uh, see you in a minute. Uh, Clamato. Uh, Are we in almost Manhattan. done? Yeah, yeah. Oh, in the oh, oven. In oh. the oven goes Mary Jo's leak. See you in a minute. <laughs> Upper. Oh, dear. I'm therapy, back. Therapy in I'm, motion. I'm back. You are. With your shirt that I won. Yes, you did over win the it. And you know what? What? You're not getting it back. I don't want it back because you know why? You look so sexy and hot and I want you now. Come to me. I've Come added, to me now. I've added in my dried herb mixture, which is a bay leaf and some salt, pepper, dried thyme, and some dried basil. And I put it, what are you looking at? Oh, uh, nothing. Half, uh, one quarter cup of fresh parsley into my soup. We reduce it down to a simmer. And I'm going to leisurely stroll over to you. You're not going anywhere, Mr. Stirrup Pants Baby over there. That is just, don't, e oh my gosh, Kenny. Yeah. And, and let me get this straight. You wrote a low-fat cookbook, is that correct? Uh, Nothing. Mama. Come to Mommy over here by the mama. upper dominant warming center. Mama's going to reach in and pull it out. Here we go. Finally, the moment <laughs> our viewers have waited for. Here are my lazy braids and leeks. My lazy braids and leeks. Was that a good one? Oh, that's that's a nice picture. That's attractive. That's very okay. professional. Yeah, thank you so much. I'm just going to close my uh, trap door. <laughs> Should follow my advice. And then I'm going to put my leekers here. So this is going to be so delicious. And yes, I'm baby. going to go get my mom's recipe. My mom's recipe. And. It is my chicken with mushroom sauce. Ooh. Mama. Oh my gosh. Look it at smells this. yumbles in my tumbles. There we go. Yummy in my tummy. That is wonderful. And, uh oh. What's wrong? I guess I'm putting it there, right? Well, yeah. Where'd you think you were putting it? <laughs> Caustic? I'd say something, but I. This is a family show. Yeah, and it would be the hygiene center immediately. Uh, <laughs> there are my leaks. I'd be my... sent over to the <laughs> hygiene center. be in the center. hygiene sanitation center for the next 30 shows. <laughs> to me is like a home-cooked, down-home, feel-good, oh, oh. sticks-to-your-rib type meal. Yes. Look at that. Doesn't that look good? Oh, that looks... You see, I would have preferred that over a cheese dream. Oh, Remember yeah. Remember cheese dreams oh, that my mother used to make? 
Your mom was very proud of those cheese dreams, I had to show out a great cheese. That was a bit scary. Beautiful presentation, sir. That's <laughs> lovely. Going, do you want to get, like, I'm going to get that. That's nice. There hygiene right now. You can't, you can't do that to your plate and not hygiene. Okay. Over there. And unfortunately, because you're hygiening, yeah. you can't pick up your oh. soup, so I'm going to have to wrap up the show. No, no. Kenny's Manhattan clam chowder. He's going to get it. Safety in the kitchen. Your handles might ah. be hot. Um, the chicken and my delicious lazy brazy leeks. See you next time here on What's for Dinner. Bye. Too sexy or what? Bye. Or what? Bye. I